everyone, Stephanie from Mrs. Deeds Corner here. I wanted to take a few minutes today to share with you how to make individualized Google Slide activities for your students. It's as simple as copy and paste, but I wanted to show you a visual of how to do this. So once you have purchased or downloaded your digital adaptive work binders or the digital basics activities, into your Google Drive. I have put all of my copies into one folder. You could easily have this be a student's folder or your classroom folder. However works, it's going to work easiest for you is how I want you to do it. For me, it was just putting all of the copies into one folder in my Google Drive. I've opened up the first activity, which is this one here, the copy of the digital calendar routine. Now say I wanted to make this Stephanie's morning routine. I would just change the name at the top. And that when I go back into my digital drive, it'll be changed here once it refreshes. Now, this is the morning routine that we do every single morning, but I want to add some of our activities from our morning adapted work binder into this digital activity for students so that it's like a routine that they do at school, but they have it at home as well. It gives them that sense of routine and having a schedule. So I am going to open up the personalized digital adapted work binder because this is what we do after our morning routine. I have students who work on first name, last name. So I'm gonna make this based off of just a sample student just to show you how to do this quick and easy skill. Basically, all you're going to do, I told you it was super simple, is you're going to right click on the slide that you want to copy. If you want to copy multiple slides on a Mac, you can hold down the shift button. I think on a PC, it's the control button, right? If you want to select individual ones, all you're going to do is select the slides that you want to copy, right click, copy, go into the binder that you're working on, the digital binder, right click at the bottom after the last slide or the slide before wherever you want this slide to show up. I want this to be after the making change, so I'm going to click on it and click paste. And I'm going to keep original styles. And now I have this digital page in this digital activity. I can add the student's name. And I'm going to mix up the pieces just like if they were doing the printable activity. And then I can come back to this personalized copy and I can copy these other slides. So we're going to do birthday and I can paste and I can add the student's birthday. And if I wanted to move the pieces around and mix them up before I sent the link over or the student accessed the drive, you can do that as well. If you wanted to, let's click out of this one. If you wanted to add a little bit of math or maybe some more weather into your morning binder for your students, you could copy in slides from the science digital basics. If you want them to type, basically all you're going to do guys is highlight the slides you want. You're going to copy them, go back to the slides that you're working on, and then you can put paste them wherever you want. So these are working on um, the weather. So I am going to put these after the clothing. And I'm going to paste them in, and now they're in here. So after they do this slide, they will go into the weather slides and then into how many days of school. If you don't like them there and you wanted to put them somewhere else, you can simply highlight and delete with the delete key and paste them at the bottom. And you can do this with all of your different activities. If you wanted them to work on color matching, again, you're just gonna open up the copy. You're going to choose whichever differentiated version your students are currently working on. Stephanie is just working on matching color to color. We're gonna copy, go to the end here, hit paste, keep original styles, and it is ready to go. You don't have to do anything except copy and paste. I hope that this quick tip video was helpful for you today. Thank you for all that you are doing for your students and for your families. 
I think you are absolutely incredible and you are doing an amazing job. If you need anything from me, please reach out. I'm always here to help and I hope you have a great day.